Baby time once again with Celebrate Jim Lingard. Baby. Yes. Yeah. Um, so you all know I'm constantly struggling with storage in, in our kids' rooms. Always, and right. um, I wanted to do, I, we, I did some canvas um, book covers um, recently, yeah. but I wanted to try something that was just a little bit more sort of durable, hard. So I came up with these cloud ones that are very simple to make. Oh, um, they don't take they a lot safe. of space and they fit into a lot of themes. Like Seth um, was saying that he has airplanes. He's like, oh, can I take them home? Because my kids' airplanes and the clouds will look great. You said so no. I told Totally said no. No, <laughs> oh, no, he did not. <laughs> we saw you earlier yeah. with the saw and the glue and the nails and whatnot. Uh, yep. Take us through this. Here we go. So what you're going to do is just on a piece of plywood, just freehand out your clouds. To so do the setup that I have, you're going to need two large and two small clouds. And don't stress, just make your shape. Um, and then a crescent moon. Um, go ahead and jigsaw those out, so very easy tool. And then a little bit of 60 grit sandpaper just to knock off the rough edges. You do want it. It got cloudy it's while like I was on. Bubble almost, <laughs> it was cold out there. And then you're going to get just buy a four foot um, one by four and just nail gun the, one of the big ones to the back of that and then two of the small ones um, to the front. It's really as easy as that. That's the first one. Now, to do the second one, you're going to get two smaller pieces of one by four and uh, nail gun them into a uh, L shape. Get your moon on the top and then just staple gun your moon to the cloud. And that'll make another little little shelf for you. And then all I did was just a nice thick coat of white paint and a little bit of yellow on the moon. And that's it, really that simple. And you can really adjust these sizes to whatever size wall you're mm -hmm. working at. And what's great is because then you can, you know, the kids can easily get oh, to the nice. books. You can see the front. Yeah. So very easy. Well, it's nice. And then the way they can have their heads in the clouds as they do this. Um, yeah, like but their do. feet on the ground. But their feet on the ground. There you go. Tips on the painting, just simple white? Well, I, I did simple white, but you could really get fun. You could do, you know, you could put them on your walls and do a rainbow in between them. You could do a sun, you could add stars. So really, this is a starting point to really create, you know, this sort of fantasy uh, sort of setup. Okay, so Mark, we can own. make them gray. Okay, so you want to <laughs> bring the show up. <laughs> no, I'm Ouch. Okay. Now, bring to hang up. them, what I did, well, you know, I love a French cleat just because it's super easy. Put it on the back here, attach it to your wall, and I'm going to let you talk to your um, local hardware store, tell them what kind of wall you have so you know what kind of hardware but putting them into a stud is always good mark if you want to hang that one for me there it's gonna slide these. Christina really you want to bring those books over I do I want to I'm stop reading, reading the oh, pop-up well, books look at this pop-up book it's beautiful uh, 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 uh. Uh, oh, I look careful. at Cinderella, oh, look at that, with the yeah. coach and everything. Okay, no, I don't have it. Here, okay. here, 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 hold on. Well, this goes to show you I can't hang the moon. There we go, That's there right. we go. <laughs> now, up flat on your side, Okay. down, now we want to there we go. Here's some books oh, there for we you. Go. There we go, and Here's then I guess you. hold all your books. And it's good because kids, here. you can see the front of the books. You're not just talking about the spine, which I think, you know, oh, anything right. to... My favorite, Eloise. Eloise, I that's saw this That's my favorite book. Anything to encourage kids to read, and so making this a fun place where they like oh, to go is, to their bookshelf. I got this book when I left Waterloo, Iowa, and moved to L.A. Really? to start my job, or my career as have a sportscaster. Yeah, have you read it No, yet? I can't. <laughs> I'm not quite sure where I'm going yet. Uh, it just says all the places you're going to go. And I just... So I'm, I'm still hoping it turns out well.